Uh, just finished installing a Mercury Magnetics transformer in my Edinator Tweaker 40. Uh, it had taken out, this is actually the second time a transformer has blown. It actually shorts out in the primary and took out the fuse. So the symptom was every time you powered up, it would blow a fuse. Uh, so I went through a few fuses. I um, actually had sent this amp back to Ignator before to have the same problem or fit fixed. Even though the amp's under warranty, I just didn't want to go through that hassle again. I was afraid I was going to get a bad transformer out of them after they didn't fix it correctly the first time. So um, I actually called the guys at Mercury Magnetics. They said, common problem, here's what you need. Got the transformer, got it installed. Everything worked great at first. Then uh, I noticed that there was uh, something marked surge suppressor that was cracked inside the, the amp. And I originally thought this was a metal oxide varistor. And it turns out it was not. It was actually a thermistor. So when I bypassed it, it caused a voltage spike to take out the filament in one of the preamp tubes, one of the 12 AX7 tubes. And so what, after digging through this, and the reason I'm doing this video is I just don't want other people to go through the same issue. Uh, so what I finally found out is actually it is a thermistor. Um, the difference between the two is a metal oxide varistor is actually designed uh, to eliminate outside voltage spikes, lightning, power company surges, and that's what's in most uh, electronic surge suppressors. So most surge suppressors you have on your computer use a varistor, and the idea is when the voltage spikes from the outside, the resistance goes down in the varistor, causing a short, which takes the fuse out in the device. Uh, that is not what the surge suppressor is. The surge suppressor is actually an inline, just drew a blank here, it's an inline thermistor. And what a thermistor does is it actually heats up slowly and until it heats up, it doesn't have uh, the, um, it kind of eases the power coming into the device. This is a good way to explain that. And this, um, in this case, uh, what I wound up getting was a Mouser Electronics 1 ohm 16 amp. I uh, found that somewhere on the internet, a uh, thermistor. And it seems to be working just great. So I no longer have the cracked barrister in there. The clack, well, it is a thermistor now that I know. And I've replaced it. So everything's sounding really good. I just want to save you that time. Uh, if you do notice like really low sound um, on your amp, um, it could be that that metal oxide or the thermistor just cracked on you. And this could be a problem even if your transformer doesn't go, taking out the tube. So definitely something to keep an eye out for. Uh, but keep rocking.